The next slide is an illustration of the audible frequency range or the range of possible frequencies because it does include subsonic frequencies and then very high frequencies that are above the uh, range of human hearing as they would be seen on a piano. So you'd be able to see uh, there's the grayed out notes which aren't on a real piano um, and then you'd hear you'd, you'd be able to see the gray notes on the, at the top end as well. And the audio frequency range are the ones that are highlighted and illustrated there with a blue line and along the top it's split up into these various ranges and it's a good idea to get familiar these ranges if you ever come across uh, an equalizer you'll know what that range pertains to in terms of frequencies so you'll be able to re refer and communicate with other people who are talking about audio in a way which is consistent so when I say high frequency range you know roughly what range that is um, and but I will go through them now briefly so you have the subsonic frequency range these are the frequencies which cannot be uh, heard by uh, human hearing. They could be experienced as vibrations, but they wouldn't be heard. And then you go into the very low frequency range, which again is bordering on experiencing rather than hearing. You, you struggle to discern, dis discern between different pitches at those frequency ranges, um, but they are around the range of 20 to 30 hertz. Above that, you get into the base frequency range, uh, and this is interpretable bass so you'd actually be able to distinguish the notes on a bass guitar as they were played and this range uh, ranges from say about 30 to uh, 120 hertz but it really depends on how you define uh, the limits and it's somewhat arbitrary. Above that you get into a whole uh, number of se segments I'd say which refer to uh, the mid frequency range. So the lower frequency range might be the lower end of an acoustic guitar. Uh, the upper mids might be the kind of scratchy sound on an electric guitar. And above that, you get you're in the high frequency range. So uh, this is the, the sound of cymbals uh, on a drum kit, uh, hissing or sibilance from a voice. And then beyond that, it's outside the range of human hearing. So I hope that gives you an idea of uh, what we refer to as the different ranges of sound.